What's up guys, this is GTFan712 back with another sneaker review video and this time it's the Nike Flyknit Racer in the Multicolor Colorway. These released on Nike Store on Friday, June 28th, 2013 for a retail price of $150. They're listed as Dark Grey, Black, Blue Glow, and Pink Flash. Now let's get into the shoe. On the lateral side, you can see the multicolored flyknit upper, which combines pink, blue, and yellow to create a variety of shades throughout the upper. This pattern is completely random, so no two pairs are alike. The knit upper features plenty of ventilation, both on the mid panels and on the toe box. At the center of the lateral side is a black swoosh, which covers the white fly wire, which runs from the sole to the eyelets. Lastly, the midsole is black under the forefoot and white under the heel. The medial side is symmetrical to the lateral side. At the back of the shoe, you can see the multicolored fly knit upper wrapping around the heel behind a black heel pull tab, which features reflective 3M strips, all atop a black and white midsole. At the top of the shoe, you can see the multicolored fly knit upper with open ventilation in the toe box. White fly wire composes the eyelets, which hold black ribbon laces over a black knit tongue. The top of the tongue features a black and white Nike fly knit racer tongue tag. Lastly, the insole is white with black racing script at the heel, as well as smaller road script and a Nike swoosh. The outsole of the shoe is composed of black rubber with exposed white foam cushioning and a black swoosh under the midfoot. And that will wrap up the review portion of this video. I'll give you guys some detailed shots of the shoes now, and then I'll lace them up, and we'll see how they look on feet. And that's it for this review of the Multicolor Nike Flyknit Racer. The Multicolor Upper looks excellent in person and the shoe is extremely comfortable and breathable, making for an excellent summer shoe. Until next time, just stay tuned to my channel for more quick looks and video reviews of shoes I have in my collection as well as pickups I'll be getting in the future. But until then, this has been GTFan712. Thanks for watching.